Biggest thing with students in particular is when they hear the networking word, um, they automatically have a conception of what that means. And it's typically kissing up to somebody, <laughs> talking to somebody that they probably didn't want to talk to anyways, and it's only for a job. Um, and I think that a big part of what we have to do at the beginning of this process when we use the word networking is to try to demystify it, make it seem a little bit more casual, help students understand what it's, what's in it for them really ultimately. Um, and so we have a series of workshops. We, we talk about it obviously individually. We have an event called Art of Mingling, which kind of takes it from, you know, a networking professional suit and tie to more of like, oh, you're at a party or you're at a gathering or, mm -hmm. you know, how do you blend in? So it's kind of the do's and don'ts almost of networking. Um, but as far as capturing what you can, you know, what you ultimately the goal is, is to get information out of that. Um, it's really as simple as kind of pointing out what the strengths are of this opportunity and what, you know, what are you hoping to gain? For some people, I think networking is really, it's to get an internship or a job. Um, but we like to introduce that concept as early as freshman year, uh, networking, kind of tying it in hand in hand with an information interview. Um, so helping students understand, okay, when you're talking to this person, what are you, what are you really hoping to get? Um, you know, what's important to you to find out from this person about the career path or what kind of education or values.